as semiconductors and other high technology likely to take center stage at Camp David, or Yi Shihu looked around one of South Korea's largest chip-making sites to see what fosters the nation's breakthrough innovations. South Korea is a key producer of some of today's most advanced semiconductors, and here at SK Hynix is where core R&D and production take place. Welcome to the chipmaker's headquarters in the city of Ichan, about 60 kilometers southeast of Seoul, housing the world's largest memory chips production plant. We develop and supply advanced products like the industry's highest 3-2-1 layer NAND flash product, which was recently unveiled. As for DRAMs, we are cooperating with global big tech firms to come up with various applied products such as high-performance, high-capacity DDR5, mobile LP DDR, and high bandwidth memory. High bandwidth memory used to power generative AI devices has revolutionized data processing by stacking and connecting multiple DRAM chips like a building. It's also taken South Korean chip makers to new heights amid the growing demand for next generation semiconductor products that support AI technology. We developed the world's first generation HBM product back in 2013, and we've been leading the market since developing and certifying next-generation products. With the market expected to grow drastically in years to come, I think the HBM will play an important role in our business. And with discussions on technological cooperation between South Korea, the U.S. and Japan expected at the trilateral summit in Camp David, the ruling People Power Party lawmaker Song Seok Jun, who represents the city of Itan, says he looks forward to such cooperation. The U.S. has great strength in semiconductor design, Japan in materials, components and equipment, and South Korea in the production of semiconductors that utilize such technology. With South Korea having leading firms such as SK Hynix, I look forward to close trilateral cooperation in fostering talent, R&D, supply chains, investment and incentives. An expert in digital strategy echoes the need for such partnership. It's very important to have a global cooperation to pursue the frontline technology of semiconductor business together. Semiconductor industry requires a tight cooperation in the supply chain to advance the economy and the technology. Now all eyes are on the three countries' next steps forward and the influence they will have on the global semiconductor industry. Yi Shi Hu, Arirang News, Yi